to the conservatory of cactus so we could take our first shot um and and see how the background of the dress looks it's going to be incredible so come with me Yes, okay. This, I feel so beautiful. You look so beautiful. I feel so beautiful. How does that shot look? Awesome. Okay. Okay, so he arranged everything, everything, everything. He is awesome. Marco. Mm -hmm. That's Marco. <laughs> the biologist. That's the biologist. Mm -hmm. e Luis e Manolo. Hello. And you say hi too. Hi. Gerard. Gerard. Graphic designer. Yeah. Yes. So this is like coming together so beautifully. And I am excited to see how everything actually comes out. So okay, stay guys. Tuned. We're moving to the next location for some beautiful photos i was able to actually capture something gorgeous and i was super happy super happy can i stand up on there yes that's what we were thinking yes oh look at that oh yeah i like this this would be like a, a fairy tale. Story. Yes. Let me, let me. We're going to the next spot to keep working. Stay tuned. Okay, guys, so that is a wrap. I'm like all melted and sweaty. My lashes are like off, but it was an incredible day. Thank you to Jose, Luis, Marcos, the biologist, the biologist. The biologist. of course, Pablo. Look, I mean, if it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have all of these amazing shots. Manolo, the guy Hello. who has the eye, who is telling me, hey, Michi, turn this way. Yes. He is incredible, you guys. If you need photos or you need a beautiful place to take your wedding photos or something special, you need to check out the Botanical Gardens. It is incredible. I, I could have imagined how beautiful my images would come out, but I'm really, 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 really happy. Okay, till next time. Hey guys, it's Michi. Welcome back to my channel. I know you guys have been with me all day here in the Botanical Gardens, but now it's lunchtime and I'm parched after all of that smiling and in the heat, we have Marcos here and he's going to explain to us how these leaves and these flowers work. Yay! Okay, 
Okay, uh, so many things that we have here in the garden, for example, we have the plum leaf. Mm -hmm. This one actually is it up. I was supposed to mm -hmm. eat that. Mm -hmm. Please, taste it. I, I'm greedy. <laughs> I wanted the leaf. <laughs> I know they went and got it, but I, mm -hmm. for me, I'm mm -hmm. But well, I have to try it first, so um, I'm not cheating her. I mean, not poisons. <laughs> it really tastes like plum. Mm -hmm. I can't even believe it. Does it have a color? Yeah. I if you grind it up, does it have color? No. No? no? Really. Now what about these leaves? Can you explain mm -hmm. these ones? Well, with the high viscous tea, uh, we have the begonias. 80% uh, of the begonias that we grow inside the botanical garden, they are also eatable. Mm. It's really good. Now, explain to them about these straws. Sure, of course. Well, uh, here in the garden, uh, we don't use plastic anymore. So one of our things that we do, we take these bamboo straws that we grow inside the garden, we make a hole, we clean it, and we serve it in our exotic drinks inside our restaurant, Hacienda de Oro. And this is a really good drink. Honestly, I'm really picky on drinks. This one is delicious. It is outstanding, actually. So. Thank you again, Marco, You're for welcome. showing us that you can eat leaves and plants and be good, okay? Till next time, bye you guys.